Hi everyone, welcome to Salesforce Developers YouTube channel. Imagine configuring a smart assistant that allows the users of your application to manage their task using simple everyday language. This is the core of conversational AI. Speaking of which, at Salesforce, we have our very own AI assistant called Einstein Copilot. Now, developers, you have a very big role to play as you extend its capabilities to fit your specific business needs. In this video, we will explore what Einstein Copilot is and how it works. Hi, I'm Mohit, a developer advocate at Salesforce, and welcome to brand new series on Einstein Copilot for Salesforce developers. Let's begin with understanding of what is Einstein Copilot. Now, Einstein Copilot is a conversational AI assistant for Salesforce. It understands your organization's metadata and data, including the permissions that you have configured, and you can ask it to perform actions using just everyday natural language. Like here, I'm showing how a service rep can find high priority open cases by simply asking it in a natural language format. Einstein Copilot comes pre-built with library of standard actions. Now these actions can be used to find records, summarize them, draft sales emails, aggregate data and give you that aggregation number and, and more. And you can enhance these Copilot capabilities by creating your own custom actions using Apex, Flows, or Prompt templates. We'll deep dive into custom actions in probably another video, but for now, let's explore some of these standard actions. Now, a common standard action that I often use with Einstein Copilot is to summarize records. So let's see this in action. Now here, I'm asking Copilot to summarize this case for me. Now, if you were to do this without the help of this Einstein Copilot, it would have taken considerably more time. Einstein Copilot can also understand the context of the conversation. For example, it can figure out who the customer is for this case that we just summarized. Now, because it remembers we were discussing this case, therefore it can provide the customer information without needing to specify the case again. Next, how does Einstein Copilot work? Now, the journey begins when a user starts a conversation in the Einstein panel. So let's say you ask Copilot, summarize this Acme deal for me. Now, behind the scenes, what happens is we take these actions that Copilot has access to and the conversation history and generate an advanced prompt. Now this prompt is sent to a large language model through our secure gateway called Einstein Trust Layer. Now this trust layer ensures masking PII info, it filters toxicity, ensures LLM is not retaining any of your data. Now the LLM uses the names and the instruction for each copilot actions to identify the best matching actions based on the user's intent. Now, because the LLM can analyze these actions, it puts them in the right order for execution. This ordered list is also known as plan. The LLM's ability to create this plan is also called reasoning. Now, for example, in this case, our plan will first include querying for this opportunity record and then summarizing it. Copilot then executes the actions based on the order generated by the plan while respecting all of the user permissions that you have configured. Therefore, here Copilot first execute the query action followed by, you rightly guess, that summarization action. Now, if you're wondering how as a developer you can peek into all of the chaining of the actions and its execution, say hello to this Copilot builder. Now, Copilot Builder is where you can build, test, and debug all these Copilot actions. Now, how do you access these Copilot Builder? You can access it via the setup, like here I'm showing here. Now, here, let me execute this prompt, summarize this Acme deal for me, and see the action chaining and the execution. 
you can observe how the query action has first invoked and then its results are fed to that subsequent summarized record action for execution. That is it for the video. In the upcoming video, we'll learn how to set up Einstein Copilot. Meanwhile, here are some of the resources for you to get started with Einstein Copilot. The first link here is where you can sign up for a five day trial org with Einstein Copilot access. Now, if you have enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to the Salesforce developer channel. So you get notifications when we post new videos. Thank you for watching.